Hey Pink Squad, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome. So, I don't know why my camera looks so dark today. Like, I try to move my settings and everything and I just do not know what I moved. I know I changed my settings in my Dallas trip, so please excuse if it does look a little bit dark. I don't know why it's that happening, but... I hope it looks better in the camera. So today we are doing a Shop Miss A haul. Now, if you're new to my channel, I usually go to Shop Miss A every three to four months in their main locations, either of their main locations in Dallas. So this camera is just getting on my nerves. So yeah, I went to their Arlington location i have been to irving i have been to grapevines and so far grapevine it is my favorite location i was going to go back but we had a little bit issue on heading out there because it's we we just cannot get on the freeway for some reason um besides that i'll be leaving time steps time stamps in the description box below because there's a whole bunch of tea behind my trip now this was supposed to be a vlog style i was supposed to vlog the store i always vlog every store for y'all but there's some tea behind that so i'll be giving you the tea if you want to know the tea go ahead and check the description box below or if you're just here for the haul to see what i got then also check the description description box below but other than that guys i hope y'all enjoyed this video and uh, let me know what y'all think about the tea because i took it in a bad way and i don't know if i should have taken it in a bad way in a good way but actually i drove five to six hours to this store okay imagine if you just drive five to six hours but anywho let me start off with the tea and then we're gonna go ahead and jump on the oh so let me start off with the tea girl okay so this is what happened <laughs> this is what happened so you already know i'm based in houston four hour four hour and a half drive depends on traffic i woke up at 3 30 in the morning only slept around three four hours we drove we went we arrived we even arrived really late. We we arrived around nine something. So we arrived. We arrive at my um, family. We went to our family and everything. So we arrived there. They're located in Cleburne, Texas, which is an hour away from Arlington, an hour and fifty away from Grapevine. I always go to Cleburne every time I go, so I do have to make that extra hour to hour drive. So we get there, um, we went during the afternoon, it was around three-ish, so that happened. So we go, we were gonna go to Grapevine, we had a problem with the freeway because we didn't want, did not want to take the tall way, so we could not go to Grapevine, but I want to go Grapevine. So we ended up going to Arlington, which Kimmy, if y'all know Kimmy, um, have ne has never went to the Arlington location so I could not meet up with Kimmy she's actually on vacation so yeah if not I wouldn't have went with Kimmy anywho we arrive it took us forever to arrive the parking lot was horrible so we had to walk a good distance that happened so when that happened I had my camera I was vlogging the whole way um, so I had the girls with me. It was me and the two other girls, which they're kind of like my cousins. <laughs> yeah, I call them my cousins. Anywho, um, so yeah, that happened. We arrived, we went, and we had a struggle to find Shop Miss A. So we find Shop Miss A. It's packed. Okay, understand that Miss A is always packed. So since Miss A was packed, I walk in, have my camera, you know. I had we had kids and we had you know all the guys were with us it was three guys it was three of us and the babies and everything so everybody splits up together like everybody splits up all over the way we go crazy in there so that happened and I had the camera inside my basket so you already know I don't like to record without asking for permission now last time I asked shop miss a if I could record in their great white location they were like heck yes go ahead no problem so this time I was like you know what I didn't have time to 
contact shop miss a they didn't have a problem last time maybe they won't have a problem this time but as y'all remember i love the great by location because they were super super nice like the manager there she was so so nice she helped us out uh if y'all have not seen that video i'll link it in the description box below if i can but she was so 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 nice the nicest person i could ever meet like that store was organized well stocked employees were super nice like they were super helpful and everything did not matter if it was packed or empty it did not matter they were nice to us so we arrive at the arlington location we go inside it's packed four employees there's four employees four four employees listen to this there's four employees in the register so that's one thing there's a reason why so that happened and then i go up to the register i was right beside the register i was looking for the girls and then the one of the cashiers was like oh my god i love your eyeshadow i was like thank you so she was nice she she was nice um the rest did not even say anything so yeah so i told her how like hey i you know ask her nicely obviously because i mean why should i be rude so i asked her nicely like, hey could i speak to your supervisor she was like oh yeah she was like she's right here she is the supervisor so she points at the girl right beside her points at the girl right beside her she looks at me and i'm like okay what's with the smile like hey how are you doing how can i help you or something because i work in retail retail before and i was always nice no matter what i was nice so she could have said how may i help you or yeah like hey how are you doing how can i help you or something you know whatever she didn't say hi she didn't say how can i help you she just freaking stared at me and i'm like okay she was just like like yeah what like what do you want so i understand the lines are long but they have four employees in the register so i was like whatever so i didn't take it in the bad way so i was like oh i was like hey um do you mind if i could talk to you for a quick sec she was like well give me one second so i was like okay that's fine i'll wait understand you're busy you're working so i was just standing there you know just my my own business on snapchat just standing there for five minutes or maybe more so i was just standing there and how would you feel if you're just standing there and like this girl just did not want to talk to me and like there were you know gossiping between each other like whispering gossiping bet between each other like looking at me in between i'm like is there something wrong with my makeup or is there something wrong with my face or do you know me or something you know so girl tell me why she kept me right there he's just standing like there and the girl that admired my makeup she said just go ahead and admire her and i'm like what and she did a face and she was like like really i have to go like in my understanding if you were busy first of all she didn't say even hi or how can i help you or anything like that she just looked at me i didn't even talk rude to her if she was busy she could have been like, yeah you know what i'm kind of busy right now can you just give me a second let me just go ahead and take care of the customers or at least something nicely and polite i'm driving freaking five hours five hours and a half wasting my gas wasting my money to go to their store for me to vlog for y'all y'all love this videos y'all always tell me to you know record the videos vlog the videos y'all want to see because not everyone has the chance to go to the shop my space store so she looked at me and she just know i was like you know what admire her like you could have just said something like you know what hun i'm too busy right now can you just give me a second or sure like okay sure well i'm busy right now but you can go ahead and tell me what you need or something nice not just standing let me stand like stupid right there like ignoring me or your you know your other employee telling me just go ahead and admire her oh like what kind of service is this so i got so mad they kept me standing like they're like stupid 
was rude in the first start that I asked her nicely if I could talk to her. I don't know if she's seen my camera or not, but even though if you know I'm a YouTuber, you best believe I'm going to blow you out like that. Fourth of all, go ahead and admire her. Like, girl, I'm over here driving a whole bunch of hours away. It does not even matter. What if, what if I was, you know, trying to find a product or what if I had a bad... Um, thing or what if I wanted to see if I could get an appointment with y'all or you know what if I was just a random customer with a random question would you just leave me standing like they're like stupid like what kind of service is that I took it in a bad way just uh, as soon as she said just go ahead and admire her I turned my back around and I was like you know what this is some BS I'm never coming back I they make me feel like shit like to be honest it just made me feel like shit and I was like, did not even want to shop again. You know, the girls were like, well, you know, you already drove over here. You know, just go ahead and shop and just whatever. So I was like, you know what? Okay, fine. I just grabbed some stuff. I didn't even grab much. It made me feel like shit. And customer service was horrible for me. Nothing like grapevine. So I was like, this trip was such a waste. But that's what happened. And I'm like until this day i'm still mad because they just let me standing there for more than five minutes like looking at you i'm dead straight looking at you that you're talking shit about me and you're just like like bitch just go away but anyways when i went away they just kept staring at me like for a good while like they kept staring at me i want to get some lashes so they should they just kept staring at me like bad i was like uh if y'all think i'm gonna pop out the camera or if y'all think I'm going to start recording with the phone or something, I'm like, best believe I'm not going to do that to get kicked out of in front of a lot of people. So I was like, did not even feel comfortable. Everything was not even stock. Everything was out of stock. Um, even the girls were saying, there's nothing here. I was like, I know everything's empty. Everything's not even like, it was horrible. That store was so unorganized. It was everything was empty and every, I know there's a lot of customers but if you know there's a lot of customers keep your store well stocked knowing there's gonna be a lot of customers knowing y'all have four employees at the register knowing that you can get keep everything maintained like the grapevine location they kept it well maintained they have everything well stocked and everything so horrible experience let me go ahead and start with the so this is what I got. It's not much, guys. I only spent $60. Um, so pretty much just got the basic stuff. The basic stuff that I need for, you know, well, I just got the basic stuff that I need for, that I really wanted to get. I'm telling you, they did not have everything well stocked. I was looking for the Lexus lashes in the five pack or six pack or six pack, yeah. And they're out of stock, so I was like... They only have these three. These are the Luella lashes. You already know I love, love, love Luella lashes. So I did pick up three of them. I picked up a whole bunch of lashes, to be honest, because the shipping, though, ain't no joke. I live four hours away, and they take two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks two weeks and a half to arrive here so that's nuts that's just nuts um i did get the alexis lashes just these look hella fake i don't know why usually they don't look like this and they just cray cray but i mean they're a dollar so i'll make them work i did went crazy on the sponges you already know i love 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 their sponges so I totally went crazy on these sponges. No joke. I went crazy on these sponges. I, I'm going to show you all the sponges that I got. But I got two of their pop-out blenders. They don't sell these in packages anymore. They have a big bowl full of them. And I don't know why the light keeps going in and out. But uh, they had these by themselves. I already dropped them again. They don't sell these anymore as... Um, their uh, packaging so I got two of those six of the regular blenders all black because I mean why not because they get stained so bad so I got six of their black blenders got two of their mochi blenders um, these are like 
they feel the same as the pop-up blenders i don't know why they say not too dense not too soft or something like that but these were a dollar 88 um one of y'all asked me if i was gonna get the mochi blenders i just don't know the difference but i got two of those and i got two of their wonder blenders i got the one that looks like the fancy sponge and i got the egg drop again because i love these and i want to give it another try i shouldn't got more blenders i did pick up their peach scented soaps these are sheet soaps i seen on shop miss a oh you wash your hands with these but anywho i seen these um that shop miss a uses these to wash their wonder microfiber blenders so i was like i'm gonna buy two see if they work and if they do and they help the fibers out because i know some of y'all were telling me not to use the zote bar so i got these see if they help with the um microfibers so let me know if y'all want to see a review on that but i really want to smell it and it smells nice it does smell like watermelon I mean, I want one. It does smell like peach and it's like plasticky feeling. But it does smell so good. So, okay. I got this little fan just because when I'm doing like my makeup and everything, and you know, I always use whatever packaging of contour kit or whatever that I'm using. So, I just got this to blow my setting spray. Another Alexis lashes. Shouldn't got more, but they were out of stock. I have two of their scissors because I have two of them and I'll always lose the heck out of them and then I'm hunting for them so I only have one right now but I bought two more. I wanted their tweezers but I can never find their tweezers in stock in stores so I don't know if they sell them in stores. So I got one of their brush cleaners. I already have one but I want to have a backup. So I picked up all of their pressed powders in beige they had like all of them girl all of them i was thinking about getting like 10 of these but there were i got all of them that were in the shell so i got two four six seven yeah i wish i wouldn't have grabbed 10 i go through these like crazy this is my everyday setting powder so all of them are in beige and these will last me at least three to four months but i'll be ha i'm gonna have to order more online because like i said they're out of stock and i did pick up their uhd pro setting spray um, i don't know if this is good if y'all have tried this out let me know but i picked it up they have their primer spray uh, so I hope this is good. I never tried it. It's what is five like five dollars. So I hope it's good. I found their pop sockets. I really wanted their unicorn pop sockets. I just found the um this zebra print and this little kitty cat right here, which is so cute. I love their pop sockets, but they're always sold out in online and in stores. They had like really really weird pop sockets so those were the cutest ones they had i did pick up some brushes i love their brushes so mostly these are my like my to go to go brushes um this one right here is the high definition e104 i love 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 this brush this is, our, this is gonna be i have three of them in total besides these two um i love these brushes to blend out my concealer on my eyes so these are the e104s and then i got a e16 e116 i love this one to set my brows with powder whenever i'm doing my brows i just use this brush to um set my brows with powder and then i got a e122 i got this one to try to do a cut crease like try me you know just put concealer on or i got the e no this is the f16 brush and the e122 so they're both like great for um cut creases so that's what i got them for got another one of their e104 so i have four total now huh i did not know because girl i get lazy and then i don't wash my brushes often and then whatever clean brushes i have that's what i use so might as well have backups oh i picked i shouldn't have picked up one of their other highlighter brushes but i don't think i've seen them i picked up this one this one is the f14 brush this is a blush brush um 
so i just picked it up for blush obviously oh two more um i got another e114 like i said this is my third one already then <laughs> um like i said i love this brush for setting the brow i got oh girl i got two e116 so i got like three or four on my trip now so okay i went crazy oh they had these in stores these are their diamond eyeliners and all the colors that i just did not know if they were gonna work or not this is the santi glitter liner and for the seams, seams of it, it's not what I thought it was going to be. Why do I look so dark? I don't know why I look so dark. But anywho, got that. That's all I got. Usually I spend like almost $100 every time I go. And I guess I just didn't do it. Um, I got my coworker a brow pomade. This is in medium brown. She's always been asking if I know a good cheap brow pomade. I always tell her that try the AOA. So I told her I like I'll just grab you one because I use my oh this is yeah, this is medium brown. I shouldn't have got her a deep brown. But I got her medium brown, my bad. <laughs> and then I got the AOA perfect blushes. These are so darn tiny like when they came out i was like i don't need any more blushes but man i seen these in person i was gonna get their highlighters and i totally forgot what the what the colors were that i was gonna get but i got in dandy and i got wispy which they're both mauvey colors they look alike but this one is more pinky and this one is more nudish so they're two different colors but i love blushes so but they're just so tiny but they're only a dollar does not matter i don't go through blushes that much but that is pretty much it guys like i said i did not feel comfortable shopping around and everything was out of stock so i didn't get much that is just it's a miracle they have their sponges in stock when i had gotten more lashes i know i didn't get more lashes that's the whole reason i was going for was for lashes and makeup and um yeah this this haul is gonna suck ah but anyways guys um yeah i hope y'all enjoy this little little haul i drove five hours away just for 60 dollars might as well wouldn't have ordered it through online but i'll be placing another order online i mean i need it i need it i i can't stop buying a shop miss a just because of that but shop miss a really needs to, needs to amp up their customer service and their shipping i mean come on y'all been doing this for a good while but anyway guys i hope you enjoyed this video any questions as always let me know in the comments below i hope y'all stick around and subscribe to my channel and join the pink squad fam because merch is almost coming soon girls so there's another tea video on that once i get the merch in but other than that guys i hope y'all enjoyed this video and i'll go ahead and see y'all on the next one bye